everybody, well, uh, my name is Furious Gamer, and welcome back to another tutorial. Today, uh, we're going to be doing the Royal Navy HMS Ark Royal. Um, the Ark Royal um, was a ship in her own class. Um, Ark Royal class, I guess, was ordered in 1940, uh, 1934, laid down in 1935, and launched on the 13th of April, 1937, officially uh, commissioned in, on the 16th of December, 1938. Uh, her pennant number was 91, and she uh, received multiple honors and awards. One of those, uh, which is why you're probably here, uh, the Battle of the Bismarck. Um, during the Battle of the Bismarck, she had launched, um, I can't remember the name, what the plans are called. She launched some torpedo, uh, launcher, uh, launchers, or torpedo bombers, whatever, to hunt down the Bismarck, and she was responsible for disabling the Bismarck's rudder. Um, and she was officially sunk by U-81 uh, on the 14th of November, 1941. So, pretty uh, interesting ship. Uh, you can go read her Wikipedia article Pretty, uh, pretty detailed. Um, she's a pretty nice looking, uh, carrier. Uh, only ship of her class, unfortunately. Um, really weird stern, but, um, that's not an issue. Um, once again, like multiple previous tutorials, and quite a few more to come. Uh, this is not mine. This belongs to my friend Hayate. Um, so, give him credit down below. Don't tell me it's good. Um, usually he pops up here and there in the comments section. But, uh, yeah, overall, really nice looking. Um, I can already tell this is going to be a really long tutorial. But, uh... Yeah, I, I, I uh... Probably... My second favorite Royal Navy aircraft carrier act after, uh, Illustrious. Which will come. Uh, Hattie has uh, her as well. Now, the reason I have two Arc Royals right next to each other is because it does. She's not 100% the same on both sides, so I'm gonna be uh, using sides of these while I build it. But yeah, um. Without further ado, let's move on to layer one. Alright, so moving on to layer one. Go to the front, place one brick wall, then one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. For terracotta. Then one, two, three for top slabs. One, two, three, four, five for terracotta. One, two, three top slabs. Then one, two, three, four, five for terracotta. One, 
two, three, four, five, six, seven. Brick top slabs coming off the fifth red terracotta, and then fill in behind that um, those uh, top slabs. One, two, three. Terracotta with one, two, three, four brick uh, top slabs. I call this for the lag. And then on the inside, one, two, three, four brick top slabs. Then in the center, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Red terracotta with one back face from normal stair. Um, and you want a smooth sandstone slab and then two brick walls. You want to go to this top slab right here, put an end rod on it, and a sandstone slab. And rod should be facing backwards. And then if you copy that to the other side, that is uh, layer one. All right. Um, moving on to layer two. On top of the previous brick wall, you want to put another brick wall, and then one, two, three, four, normal red terracotta, then one, two, three, four, more red terracotta, with a top brick slab coming off of that uh, last red terracotta, then one, two, three, four, five, six, red terracotta, Two top brick uh, slabs on those last two for terracotta. Then one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen for terracotta. And one, two, three, four. Red brick top slab. And then one, two, three, four, five. Red terracotta. One, two, three. Top brick slabs. Then one, two, three, four. Red terracotta. One, two. Brick top slabs. And then one red terracotta brick slab coming off of it. Backward facing upside down brick stair. And then brick top slab coming off of that. And then that is, <clears throat> sorry, uh, layer two. I'm going to copy that over to the uh, left side. And then, that is layer two. Okay, moving on to um, the next layer. Uh, I'll be right back. Okay. Moving on to layer three. This is the last, mostly, um, symmetrical layer. From uh, this point on, we're going to be doing an entire layer. Be, uh, go to the front of the ship. One, two, three, four. 
normal stone, and stone slab. Then one, two, three. Okay, never mind. Um, I'll be right back. Okay, my apologies about that. Um, you wanna go to the front? One, two, three. Uh, four. Stone blocks. One stone slab. Polished black stone button in front of it. And then one, two, three. Three, two stone buttons, stone slab, and then one, two, three, four, five, stone, one, two, three, uh, black stone polish buttons, and then one, two, stone top slabs, and then one, Two stone polish black stone uh, buttons. One, two, three fence gates, and then one, two, three, four normal stone, and then one, one, two, three, four, five, six. Normal stone with one, two, three, four, five, six stone, uh, black stone buttons, and then two empty stone blocks, and then one, two, three, four, five, six, seven stone with one, two, three, four, five, six, and seven polished. Uh, black stone buttons, and then one, two stone top slabs, and behind that, one, two stone with one, two stone coming off of it, buttons on both block, and then stone top slab, stone button behind it. And then one stone block, and then the backward facing uh, stone stair, acacia signs, two, just like that. And then one, two stone blocks with a polished black stone button on it, like that. And then you want another um, stone stair and stone block two acacia signs and then stone block stone slab one two and two buttons and then one two more stone slabs on the side. One, two, three, four stone blocks of buttons. And then one, two, three, four, five blocks without buttons. And then one, two, three, four, five, six, seven blocks of buttons. And then one clean stone block, one, two stone blocks buttons, and then one, two, three stone blocks with fence gates off of them, and one, two polished black stone buttons, and then one, two, 
one, two. Top slots with stone behind them. And then one, two, three. One, two, three buttons. One, two. Um, stone. Top slots. One, two. And then one normal stone. Stone slab coming off of it. Button in front of that slab. Button in front of these two slabs. So when you're done, you should have something that looks like that. And then... Um... Fence posts as well with item frames and normal uh, with skull skulls. Probably want to get rid of one of these so you can get it. Oh, doors. Alright. So, one stone at the front. one with stone slab coming off of it and a wither skeleton skull then stone block with button on it and then and then a block with top slab on it and then one, two, three. One, two, three buttons. And let me see what we got going on here. Um so, stone top slab, another stone stair, forward facing, and then so, um, Side facing stair, normal stair, side, two side facing, um, put fence post on that side facing stair with a fence gate coming off of it and then on this first side facing stair put a fence post and then one Stone block, one, two, side facing uh, stairs, and then one, two, three, um, stone with one, two, three, and a side wall coming off of it with three item frames off of it like that and then two uh, quartz blocks with stone behind them and then let's see top slab trap doors But there we go. Top trap doors. So you got that. And then stone block. With a wall. Coming off of it. And then two quartz blocks. 
box. Stone behind them. Uh, same with the trap doors. Um, I apologize if this is hard to follow. And then a full stone block, two quartz slabs, and then two uh, stone block behind them. And then one uh, normal stone block, side facing stair. And then we're getting into stone block with birch sign on it. Normal. Stone uh, side facing stair with birch uh, coming off, birch sign coming off of it, and then uh, normal stone block. Two side facing stairs. One, two, normal stone with buttons on them. Uh, stone block with fence coming, fence post coming off of it. And then one, two, stone with black stone buttons. And then stone slab with. Side facing stair on the inside block right there. And a normal stone block, polish button on it. And then um, stone stair off the side. And then top slab coming off of it. And then no stone block on the inside. Stone uh, back facing stair. And then a stone block. Um. Back to the front. No second stone block. Put a top slab on it with a skeleton skull. And then full block with no skeleton skull coming off of it. Full block button on it. Full block top slab on it. One, two uh, blocks with buttons on them. And then one, two, stone, top slab coming off first, forward facing stair coming off the second, put a birch fence gate on the second, um, and then a stair, and then put a fence gate. On the stair, let's see. Okay, and then stone two side facing upside down stairs with I think I did something wrong. Okay, never mind. Put fence post on this stone block and then one 
normal stone block with a button on it, two side facing uh, stairs, one, two, three normal uh, stone blocks with buttons coming off, and then one, two, um, slabs with top slabs and top doors. One, two, bottom slabs, and then stone blocks. Give me a sec. Sorry about that. Um, and then the block with a wall coming off of it, and then two. Uh, bottom slabs uh, of quartz, and then one, two, um, top iron trap doors on the front, and then two normal stone blocks off the back, and then put another block, two normal side facing uh, stairs. And then, uh, stone block, stone stair with birch, uh, sign off of it, normal stone block with birch sign off of it, and then stone stair with birch sign off of it. And then, full block, two side facing stairs, one, two, three, four, five blocks with polished black stone uh, buttons coming off of them and then top slab with a stair coming off of it on the inside and then stone block on the other side button on that one and then side facing stair And then top slab, stone block behind it, and then stone stair, and then on the inside you have this stone block. And that is layer what four? Yes, that is layer four. Put a stone right stone block on the front, stone stair coming off of it on this, and then stone top slab coming off of either side. Stone, uh, normal stone block um, two normal stone blocks actually and then a top uh, iron trap door going off of it and then And upside down uh, side facing stair. Iron trapdoor coming off of it. And then stone block with a button on it. And then top 
of center stair with top um, trapdoor on it. Okay, actually, uh, go back the blocks. Uh, we have these. We have this uh, upside down stair with a stone block next to it. Um, go to this block. One, two. And put uh, the upside down stair, no, normal stair, like that. And then trap doors coming off of it. And then stone with a button on it. And then normal stair with top iron trap door. And then uh, put another trapdoor off of that one. And then stone block with stone slab coming off of it. And then full block, full block, full block with button on it. And then full block fence post on it, right? Yeah. And then two full blocks. And then two uh, uh, stairs upside down facing opposite directions. And then Uh, full block button, full block top drop door, full block button, and then full block item frame. Full block, upside down stair coming off of it. And then full block with nothing on it. Full block, uh, top slab. No, not top slab. Uh, upside down side facing stair coming off of it. And then two stone blocks on top of the previous ones. And then two bottom uh, quartz slabs. And then stone block with andesite wall off of it. And then two full blocks, bottom uh, quartz slabs on it. And then a birch fence gate coming off of the first uh, trap, off of this top of this first trap door. And then normal full block, full block with button on it, full block, full block, top trap door, one, two, three, four, full. Uh, blocks, one, two, three, four, buttons coming off of them, 
a sec. There we go. And then flip lock with forward facing full block. No forward facing um top slab. Um, you also want to go back to the front. And then forward facing and backward facing stair on these two blocks right here. Go back to the back. Alright, and then another full block right behind that. Backward facing uh, stair. And then two full blocks, buttons on the side. Two more with stairs like that. And then Full block, two uh, slabs, put a button on that full block, and then two full blocks behind those slabs, and then full block off of that, uh, off the uh, quartz slabs, full block on top of that stair with a slab coming off of it. And then one, two, uh, top trapdoors off of that, and then uh, block off of it, and then. stair, back facing stair, coming off of that, when I'm, okay, and then stair, full block, Um, and there, and then off of so one, two, so just make that shape. Do something looks like this, and then take two normal skeleton skulls and put it on these two top slabs. All right, go back to the front. For the um, left side, you want to basically do the same thing. So, two normal blocks behind that, two um, top slabs. And then, uh, stair, two, one, two, 
uh, top stairs. Um, full block with a button on it. Stair. Then block. Block with stair. Two blocks um, with two stairs facing up directions on it. And then full block button. Normal full block. Fence post on it. One, two blocks with stone stairs facing up directions on it. Actually, this stone is a top stair and then another top stair. Full block with a button and then two top stairs, one, two, three blocks with item frames on them, and then two stone blocks with um, quartz slabs, smooth quartz slabs coming off. Um, wall, stone block behind it, two stone blocks with quartz slabs coming off of them, like that, um, and then fence gate coming off of the wall, um, wait no, these will be stairs behind, uh, on top of these slabs, and then a full block, two more full blocks, one, two, three, four full blocks with, one, two, three, four buttons, uh, on top of this full block you actually want, um, uh, uh, trapdoor, and then two full blocks, uh, stairs facing uh, different directions, block with a button, uh, another full block, two full blocks after that, facing different directions, stairs, Full block, button, two stair, not item frames, two bottom slabs, stat, four blocks behind them, and then we'll do this on the other side too. Um, top. Um, uh, trap doors like this, and then full block top item, tra uh, top full block coming off of the uh, quartz slab. Sorry, like that. And then one, two uh, trap doors. So the Trap door should be on the uh, second smooth quartz slab, and then coming off of that top slab with a uh, stone behind it, another stone with iron two iron trap doors coming off. 
that and then okay, stare uh, stare full block behind it stare on top of that and then two top slabs and then two top slabs and then once again skeleton skull on these last two and that does it for layer five yes layer five um now moving on to the last layer of the hull um you want to do first go to this center block right there and put a stair then normal stone block on either side and then normal stair on the other side coming off of it like that. And then one, two, three. Stone blocks with inward facing skeleton skulls. And then one, two, uh, no, one stone block with the top stone uh, stair, no, bottom stone stair, and then a skeleton skull on top of the trap door, and then stone block with defense post coming off of it, and then top stair with normal stone block and then andesite stair polished andesite stair with a birch fence gate on top of these uh, stairs and then one two stone blocks with open birch trap doors and then top stair with normal block coming off of it. And then one, two with a polished andesite and birch fence gate coming off of these stairs. Normal stone block with birch fence. And then upside down stair with a normal uh, skeleton skull and then one two stone blocks with trap doors coming off and then upside down stair normal block upside down stair Put a fence gate, a fence post on that stair right there, and then two normal stone blocks, and then skeleton skull on top of these walls, stone block behind it, two stone blocks with a fence gate, normal fence gate on the uh, second uh, block and then another one same way and then normal stone block upside down stone stair with end rod coming off of it with 
a skeleton skull. I have to put a placer block below it so you can get the skeleton skull on top of the um, end rod. And while we're at it, we got um, iron bars. Put one on top of this fence post. Two actually. Top of this fence post. Um, and then two iron door, iron fence, iron bars on top of that uh, fence post right there. See so that. And then one stone with fence post on it. Two iron bars on top, stone block, open fence gate, stone block, open fence gate, stone block, open fence gate, and then stone block with a upside down stone stair on the side of it with in front a back facing uh, polished and side stair with a um, fence gate coming off of it, normal block, fence gate, no, fence post with two iron bars coming off of it, and then stair, uh, normal fence gate, full block, upside down stair, Back facing and a sight with open fence gate coming off of it. One, two, um, stone with trap doors off of it, and then one, two full blocks. Uh, with the skeleton skulls coming off of it. And then one, two stone blocks. Put a button on the first one. And then in front of the second one, a normal skeleton skull. And then one. One, two, three normal blocks with button right there. And then one, two, three stone with one, two, three uh, bottom slabs. One bottom slab coming off of this normal block there as well. And that is the port side all done. Going back to the front. Um, first, I want to fill that in too. Um, one, two, three blocks with with the skeleton skulls on top of these trap doors. Um, then one stone block with stair off of it there, just like that. I forgot to do the iron trap door. This is coming off of this area. So you're going to do the same thing on the port side on the starboard side with the front like this. I don't know what I'm talking about. There. And then normal block fence post side click. Uh, no. Back, and then two 
arm bars on top of this fence post. And then open backwards fence gate with polished andesite. Um, upside down stair with stone. Then two stone, two open fence gates. Upside down stair, full block with an andesite stair and birch fence gate on the front and then one stone with birch fence gate and then one two normal stone with item frames on it and then One, two, three, four, five full blocks with one, two, three, four, five, and a set of walls coming off of it. Then one item frame, skip space, one, two, three item frames, and then back to the room hall. One full block, two full blocks. And a normal skeleton skull on top of that wall. One normal stone block. And then two with normal fence gates coming off of it. One normal block with upside down stair. And then spacer, spacer block. Skeleton skull, remove the space block, put it in rod. Just like that. And then block, full block with fence post on it. Put two iron bars. And then one, two, three. Normal stone with one, two. Three open fence gates and then normal stone with a side facing upside down uh, stair and then back facing uh, anti side stair with birch fence gate off of it and then one, two, uh, normal blocks, fence gate, iron bar, um, fence post, two iron bars on top of it, and then open fence gate. Then, back facing and the site, stair, fence gate off of it, normal, st uh, normal stone block behind the fence gate. No, not fence gate. And then, uh, stair. And then, upside down stair behind the fence, fence gate. And then, one, two, normal blocks with fen open fence gates. One, two, normal blocks with a skeleton skull. One, two, in front of it like that. And block with false black stone on it, and then um, a normal block with a skeleton skull on top of that uh, trapdoor. Normal block. Oh my gosh. And then with pulse black stone button, two stone blocks like that, and then one, two, no, just one um, stone uh, auto slab, and the hull is finished.
I'm gonna go to the front. And behind these blocks you want let's see, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So one, two, three, four, five, six, and seven. Um normal polish and a size stairs. Like that for the deck. And then on the back, you want um, to get out um, materials needed. Um, you want one, one, two, three. Four, five, six, six, um, bit concrete, then one gray concrete, one, two white concrete, and then gray concrete, and then drag. your uh, white concrete to the front just like that and then go to this block and go one two three four five six seven Eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. White concrete on the other side of the back. Just like that. And then go to the uh, skeleton skull right here and go forward one, two, three, polished anthesite blocks off of it, and then skip three blocks, and then one two, three, on the other side, and then two blocks, and then one, two, three, on the side, and then as markers, you want one, two, on that side, and then one, with a skull and skull on this side. And then you want to fill in the rest of the deck with um, gray concrete. It will be back when I get that done. Alright. Once you get that done, you want to now get out some gray carpet and for a marker for the superstructure you're just going to put one gray carpet on that block behind this with the skeleton skull and then one, two, three, four, five. Do the outline of the deck.
so now that you have that, you want to go right here. One um, stone slab, then one normal stone block, and then two. And then with end rod on this wall and fence post on this wall. And then two, three, normal stone with white, with light gray stained panels. Um, two stand panels on this side uh, a top trapdoor and then one two uh, acacia signs and then a normal skeleton skull facing back and then one two um, normal blocks on the side put a uh, tr fence post on top of the end, on top of the previous fence post, and then side facing um, skull, and then replace that top fence post with an end rod, and then put two end rods um, just like that, and then. A wither skeleton skull on that block. Get out. Dark oak signs. One, two, and then one with a stone bottom slab on that side. Um. Get out stone brick, one, two, and then two on top of that, two uh, stone blocks, one, two, one, two, glass panels off that, um, fence gate next to this um, stone bottom slab no not the fence gate um a Burke's sign next to this bottom slab and then one One, two, um, bottom, um, uh, trapdoors, and then a skull off the back of that, and then one, uh, top slab and then um turret walls and rod and then uh, 
a lever. There, and then put a lever on this block. Take some back. Put trap doors on top of these glass panels, and then a bottom slab with one, two, three fence posts, one, two, uh, skeleton skulls on the front, one, two, one, two, end rods on either side, dirt wall, top of that, and then one, one, two, um, stone bricks, and then get out blackstone slab, put two of them on top of the funnel, just like that, and that will do it for the HMS Arc Royal, uh, Arc Royal class aircraft carrier tutorial, uh, this is quite a long tutorial, uh, I quite enjoy building this. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed the tutorial. Uh, be sure to hit the little red subscribe button down below. Um, hit that like button. Maybe hit the notification bell so you can get more upcoming uh, tutorials. Maybe go check out my Discord server. A um, couple hundred people. Mm, fun place to hang out and chill. Uh, I try to be on as much as I can, so maybe you can get a chance to talk to me. But, um, yeah, again, this is not mine. This belongs to my friend Hayate, so give him credit down below if you want to compliment the build. And this is Furious Gamer seeing myself out.